give it a go. I was, I was, I was, I was trying to think of the phrase. I'll be the judge of that. My God, I feel weird today. Let's SpongeBob. There's Mr. Crab. There's Mr. Krabs, and I think that's Squidward. Like, yeah, he's like very, he's like very peeking into the. So one thing I noticed, um in my time waiting to, to put this on screen. Um, the frame rate. If I if I look at the kitchen, something about the, what is his eyes doing? Something about the way the, I don't know. I don't know if it's the way that SpongeBob grills the Krabby Patties so juicy and delectably. Um, it tanks the frame rate. Um, but if I go into this corner, we get a smooth 60 frames per second, baby! Similar, yeah, as long as I stay down here and I don't look at the rest of the kitchen. Well, actually, I can have the burgers in frame and it stays at 60. So what causes the frame drops? Is it... Oh, I see. It's the ketchup and mustard. That makes sense. Alright. Um, let's we'll start a new game. I remember being creeped out by this game as a kid. Me too, Nova Ghost! Me too! I'm not crazy! <laughs> Tank controls? Uh, it didn't seem like it. I don't think so. SpongeBob is too, like, brick like in this game for my taste. He doesn't have the. Curvaceousness what a silly of his. dream. Mr. Krabs had to close the Krusty Krab. Like that it ever happened. I have the feeling today will be like no other day. Cause today's gonna suck. I wonder where Gary is. I should probably walk him before I go to work. He moves like a Chuck E. Cheese. How how would you describe a Chuck E. Cheese the way it moves? How would you describe it? I have to grab my pants? We don't just have like a whole like Rube Goldberg cartoon contraption. Cheesy. <laughs> His eyes aren't in sync. Well, sometimes it'd be like that. Oh, this is not, this is not the extensive map layout of, of his house that we get in Battle for Bikini Bottom. This is just, a, this is a hack job of, of, a, of a layout here. This isn't lore accurate to the SpongeBob uh, mythos. His torso isn't moving. God damn it. I mean, does it matter? Does it really matter? Does it, I mean, truly, like, what, like, look at, look at all the stuff he can do. He can do this. He can do this. He can... This shit! You're gonna, you're really gonna give him shit about how much his fucking torso moves when he can do this? Is this really the kind of people we're gonna be? Is this the kind of community we're gonna represent? Because I don't, I think not. New Sonic looks great. Yeah, I love Sonic Rangers. Look at this. You know, they said it was going to be an advancement of the Sonic franchise, and I think I'm starting to understand what they mean. Wait a minute, this chair is pinker than it's supposed to be. What is- okay, I care about the shit that matters, okay? They're getting the lore of Spongebob wrong. That's really what it comes down to. It's not- it's not, you know, how it's animated. It's not how much Spongebob may or may not be moving his torso. It's, do you care about the integrity of, uh, of, of the original Nickelodeon production? And, um, unfortunately, it seems that with, with this kind of color palette, <laughs> couldn't give two shits, uh, apparently. What's in here? Don't you think your little friend Gary would like to play some fetch? Uh, yeah, I guess. I don't know, I duh. Will. Should I? Move next to his fetching stick and press the action button to pick it up. Then you can carry the stick to Gary and delight him. I don't know if I want to delight him, sir. I... I, f I, f I feel like I'm being coerced. In a way, I'm not really super down for it. You didn't think I was going to leave for work without a quick game of fetch, did you, Gary? <laughs> now come on, boy! Go long! And then... Longer! And thus... Long for decades beyond, SpongeBob never addressed 
the strange, sultry voice in his kitchen. Hmm, there's something written on it. I think it says, Damger. Damger. Oh, I... <laughs> I wonder what that means. I well, thought... We should see what's inside. I thought that was actually misspelled. I was about to... I was, oh, <laughs> I was really gonna rip into this game. Gary? What harm can there be in just a little peek? What the fuck, dude? Just what I always wanted. A muddy little bottle. How Just is that like belonged to somebody? What it. the fuck Here are his go. eyes doing? Arr, who summons me from my endless slumber? I'll have your eyes for appetizers and your insides for dessert. For I am the flying Dutchman. I don't know. I don't know if SpongeBob's <laughs> eyes are very that. ripe today. Just you might want to wait until they're a little bit more we'll in sync. Out in the yard so you can... Silence! I'll not return to that prison ever again. And what's this? You've gotten into my treasure, have you? Ooh, Why is there no music? Uh, this is actually a psychological room. horror piece. Now, what um, I do with it's, it's sort of like the uh, the beginning of Castaway. Where, like, the entire, like, plane crash happens with no sort of, like, music backing track behind it. Um, it's just supposed to instill, like, this raw anxiety. Bloody crew. I ain't never been out to sea with a talking cheese block before, but rules is rules, so I gotta take you with me. Are you ready? No. Hold on there, Mr. Dutchman, sir. Uh, technically speaking, it was not me who found you. Gary's the one who dug you up. I mean, Ooh, to be fair, like, this little varmint looks like I had that reaction earlier work. because I was kind if of appalled at SpongeBob's behavior, just the way he would take somebody else's me. property and just, no, just, no, just, you know, Gary, just smash it. Because, like, that's what he him, did. Him. We all saw it. I think he maybe kind of deserves this. I to check on the treasure stashed back on my ship to make sure no one's been spreading that around. But I'll return shortly to pick up my new crewmate. Say your farewells before I return. Don't worry, Gary. I'll think of something, and it'll be the type of. Oh yeah, he just threw Gary under the bus. You. you can bet on it. Oh. Okay. Well, <laughs> looks like the clock's a ticking. <laughs> this is a this is officially a fucking Majora's Mask kind of situation. Be a... I just wanted to give back to all the laughs your streams and video oh. have given. You have helped build up confidence so much. Sorry it's not much. Anyway, I'm off to continue to argue on Reddit. <laughs> it's all good. What else is there to do on Reddit? Uh, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Jump looks so bad. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. What were we just talking about? If we're gonna, if we're gonna critique, it has to be the stuff that actually matters. Why, like for example, why the fuck can't I get up on this fish? The community said we wanted to toxic though, Penny. Do a do a fucking recount. I didn't. I wasn't there for it. I know you did a poll. I didn't see the results though. They don't exist. Is there was there something unaddressable on screen just now? I, I completely missed it. I'm sorry. I was too busy lobbying for a, a recount. What is... Okay. So he shits. Okay, so he shits, so what? Don't we all? How many sound effects did they record for that? Probably just came from like a audio bank of some kind. Shitsounds.net. <laughs> Just shits and beats. Okay, we're in it. Oh god, oh okay. Oh oh no, oh no, oh no. Is there oh no, is there oh no, is there Oh there's no way. There's no way to 
change the camera direction. Also, oh, oh, it chugs, oh, it chugs, yeah. <laughs> Free low high hip hop beats to study and shit too. <laughs> Just like any YouTube video on my phone. <laughs> that's it's like that's 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 my relationship with like Linus Tech Tips. <laughs> Just like, all right, <laughs> what's the first thing on the recommended feed? <laughs> this game has a look. Yeah, it's 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 you know it, I would describe it as. Um, smoky. It's got like it's got like a, it's got like a it's got like a smoky kind of kind of vibe to it. Are we messed up. Okay, what is okay? What is the poll? Poll poll says we messed up in evil now. Ninety one percent said sure. Yeah, but that's only sixty four people. There's like. There's like almost 400 people watching right now. I don't think that's a big enough sample size. I'm sorry. I absolutely refuse to 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 use this 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 fucking this paltry sample size to uh to to influence the direction of my of the creative uh of the of the creative uh all my creative liberties in the direction of my stream, you know? I'm comprehensible. Oh my god. 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 It's Patrick. Oh shit. I broke his blender. I borrowed his blender and I broke it. Home sweet home. Wait. I was gonna say, when does he have a back? He, he always had a back door. What am I talking about? Use reef blower to spin the wheel. How do I? Okay, I guess I don't have reef blower. I I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be real. I have been running around this level right now with absolutely no like conscious intention to progress. Like like m like my mind today is stop fucking looking at me. My brain right now is like on another planet. Like I, I'm in like just I'm off in like like will you fucking stop. Okay, you want to look at me? Fine. Take a fucking peek. You like what you see? Can I talk to my chat now, SpongeBob? I'm gonna fucking kill you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Okay. Look uh, at this! A bus stop! <sighs> I wish I could take a long ride on the bus. Just think of all the amazing places outside Bikini Bottom and all the fun things I could do. Your wish can easily come true. I don't like this all guy. You need <laughs> is the right ticket for this bus stop. You know, I'm starting when to realize I'm starting ticket, to jump onto the bench. Understand the why when I think about playing this game as a kid, it's like with like this air of like a like a nightmare, like a feverish nightmare. Like this this is honestly kind of scary. I like I like if a lot of kids were scared by this game, I'm starting to understand why. This voice is like none none other. I think the way Patrick looks at me, I don't know if y'all saw, but like he had like... <laughs> he was like... Every time you're not looking, I'm getting closer, SpongeBob. And we're just like, okay. I really need to reach that other ledge, but I don't think I have it in me. Don't be discouraged. You can do it. Don't be press discouraged. Press jump. Then you can glide a bit farther <laughs> if you press jump again before you land. Do not be discouraged, SpongeBob. All you have to do is submit. Who would leave a letter tile sitting around like that? Yes, if it someone wanted me to find it. That is no ordinary letter tile. It is a clue. Gather all the letters that spell your name. <laughs> Like, you will have enough <laughs> to find a hidden treasure. <laughs> he 
actually do the, like, literally, like, the mouth sounds, the fucking Neil Cicerega mouth sounds, was just like, it is a clue. <laughs> it's like really, really gross. Yeah, well, it was like no energy. Hi, Penny. This is the first stream I'm catching live. Hello. And I just wanted to give back after all the laughs you've induced and the confidence slash inspiration you've given me. Especially <laughs> with my singing voice smile. Can't wait for the reconstruct. Thank you. Hey, welcome to, welcome to your first stream. I appreciate you dropping by. Sorry it's one that's like this. <laughs> also, this is it's so funny. Like, I like I'm not I'm I'm not I'm not gonna. I'm, this is not me making funny or anything. Your message is very 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 sweet. But also, I don't know how I feel about about describing me making somebody <laughs> laugh as like the laughter I've induced. Like it sounds sounds too medical. <laughs> Fucking Don't forget the hyphen between overbearing Twitch man. streamer induces At least laughter. Original on French homie from SpongeBob actually sounded like he cared. Well, yeah, it was Tom Kenny. God damn it! Why, SpongeBob? I gotta ask, SpongeBob. I gotta ask, why are you layer in pants like that, bud? You're th you, you notice that? Here, I'm gonna get hurt on purpose just to. He loses pants and he has more under. We only picked up one pair, unless he. So frequently layers his his drawers in that way and takes them off like that and then like they were just kind of like stacked like that anyway. I gotta go somewhere. I'm I'm gonna lose my shit. Krusty Krab this way. Never knew. It. <laughs> there are dozens of us. Dozens. Oh, Mr. Krabs warned me about playing hooky, but they look so fun. Maybe just one quick ride while no one's looking. Ah, you little <laughs> troublemaker. Stop! 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 But I promise Stay you with me. if you use stop, your fishing stop, net to hang from stop, them. Stop! 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 That's the only safe way to do it. <laughs> maybe, maybe if we chant stop enough, he'll fucking stop. <laughs> Use the fishing gear to hang from a hook. Does it like hurt me otherwise? And why was he so like? Oh, you silly little sponge! Slam the button. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> what the fuck? What the fuck is happening? Oh, oh yeah, so this works on like a, oh yeah, this is like a, like a costume system. I didn't know we'd have so many right off the bat. Whoa. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it's like Val in Wonderworld. Bob in Wonderworld. <laughs> Why? I mean, I guess it kind of stacks. It's like two different kinds of fishing working together, I guess. Like I'll, like, I'll bite, I'll bite to that degree. Get ready to hear this track nonstop. Hey, that's okay, it's a jam. I can't imagine any sort of reason why I would be sick of it ever, probably. Oh my God, I actually, I'm starting to like remember. Remember, <laughs> remember. Remember that we once lived. Remember that we once lived. Okay. So every... All of them, I guess, have a glide of some kind? Is that just like a standard... Spawn. It's my to-do list. Oh, this is... Vi There's like multiple sounds in there that I have yet to deduct. There's one that's like, like if you're jumping in like a creaky bed. And the other one is like, pig snore. Yeah. 
Starchies, thank you for the raid. Hi there. It's kind of wet also. Well, yeah, I mean, they live under the sea. Um, that, so there was a, there's like a reef, so this is, oh my god, I need to, I, my brain is. Remember the nightmares? Remember the nightmares? <laughs> okay. I, I haven't unlocked it yet. Then why the fuck is it there? Okay. Well, I guess I don't have the reef blower costume yet. Jelly fishing, jelly fishing. Mine. Yeah, okay, so what, so this is like a very sort of, um, uh, like Super Mario 64, if Super Mario 64 wasn't very fun, I guess. Get on to the Krusty Krab sign. Search through the Krusty Krab storage. Get rid of the thug in the Krusty Krab. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Okay. Um. Mm -mm. All right. Let's go to the. Let's get into the. So like Donkey Kong 64. <laughs> I. I feel like I should play DK 64. I. I played that game as a kid too. Um. My uncle had it in 64. Did you know? Uh, indirectly, I feel like I, I must have told this story before, but I'll say it again just for the sake of it. Did you know that Donkey Kong 64 is like indirectly the reason why I don't own a Super Nintendo? Even though I did at one point for like a month or two. Um, Specifically, uh, I would spend a lot of time at uh, my my grandparents' house, and <laughs> this coin is gonna fucking give me rabies. <laughs> I'm fucking lose my. I'm, I'm leaving. Um, I was. I'm sorry, shut up. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I would spend a lot of time at my grandparents' house, and uh, my uncle. Would live. With, my uncle lived with them, still does. But uh, he he and and he had like a bunch of like game systems. And so you know, when I was a kid, I loved video games. So I would I would spend a lot of time in in his room just playing playing old video games. And one of my favorites to play was his Nintendo 64. <clears throat> and specifically, I really enjoyed Donkey Kong 64. Um. And, uh, so we said you need to crouch and jump. Is that a thing? Oh, got it. Okay, cool, thanks. Um, uh, I really enjoyed Donkey Kong 64. So one day, years later, I'm talking like five to seven years later, um, possibly even more. Anyway, I'm just a lot older. I'm like a preteen at this point. Um, I don't know much about, like, legacy consoles. My favorite console at the time is a PS3. Like, that's, that's where my brain is at. It's like, oh, PS3, PlayStation Vita, kind of brain, right? And so, I go to my grandparents' house at one point, and they hand me this box with the Super Nintendo in it. And they're like, hey, uh, your uncle is, uh, getting rid of these. Uh, would you want it? And my brain is thinking... Well, well, I look in the box and I see, I see this game, Donkey Kong Country. And I'm like, I'm like, oh, fuck yeah, this must be the game that I really liked as a kid. I was like, oh, fuck yeah, fuck yeah. Um, I was like, yeah, I'll take it. So I, I, I take it. And there, there I have it. I have a, I have a fucking Super Nintendo and a copy of Donkey Kong Country. And I'm like... Hell yeah, hell yeah, I'm gonna go home and I'm, I'm gonna play this. I hook it up, I put it in. And of course, as you probably know, Donkey Kong Country is not Donkey Kong 64. And being the shitty, stupid kid that I am, like what happened to that really cool 3D game that I liked? This must not be it. I must have been thinking of something else. And I never played the rest of Donkey Kong Country. And eventually, I got rid of the Super Nintendo because I didn't like it. Cause it, cause it wasn't the Nintendo 64. I could have fucking had a Super Nintendo right now. 
that I like, I like, I wouldn't have to, like, if I ever wanted a Super Nintendo, I wouldn't have to, like, go out and, like, find one. Like, I just had one, and then I just fucking got rid of it. That, like, that, my original PS2, yeah, really, those are the big, that and my original PS2 are both two of the biggest, like, shit idiot kid selling a console mistakes that caused me to adopt my I'm never going to sell a video game console unless I absolutely have to, or it, like, literally just doesn't even matter at all policy. Like, I have, like... I have, like, two or three PS4s. I could get rid of, like, <laughs> like a couple of those if I needed to, right? Um, but, like, you know, like, my Wii U, never getting rid of that. Never getting rid of my Wii U. Um, never getting rid of, like, my PS3. Like, like, this just, like, I, it's never gonna happen. Because every single time I've done it, I have always, always regretted it. Oh, I'm gonna sneak up. Why do I have three PS4s? Um, uh, I actually think I have two of them with me. One of them, I think, is back at my parents' place. Um, I had the original PS4, the slim one. And then later, I upgraded to a used PS4 Pro from eBay. But it was, it was, it was like, it was kind of broken, and the fan was like really fucking loud, like ex like unreasonably loud, like just way too distracting. And I needed it for streams, so it couldn't, you know, it would it would get in it would get in the way of like stream quality if I were to do that. So then I got another used one that was like one of the later models that like were less susceptible to sound issues. But yeah. Um, I just like I just think about that sometimes. I'm just like, why did I? I was like, I really, I, I like Sony really got into my head as a kid, I guess, because I was just like, uh, two-dimensional Nintendo game. <laughs> um, it, it's uh, sorry, that's a weird way to spell a uh, peasantry. Oh yeah, the Wii was another one. My, I don't know, my family, like, well, I, I know why we did it. It was, it was, like, because we needed the money. But, like, my family went through a cycle of, like, having, like, two separate Wiis that we got and then eventually got rid of because nobody, nobody played it after we got sick of Wii Sports. Um, and, like, you know, I would get consoles as a kid, but, like, I could never get a lot of games for them. Because getting a lot of games is eventually, like, monumentally more expensive than getting a console, right? Especially if you get it, like, used. Um, <clears throat> like, I, I would, I, like, my PS3, for the longest time, was, like, a demo machine. Like, I essentially had, like, like a home PS3, like, demo kiosk. Before I had, like my own disposable income and could like afford to buy games. <sighs> okay. What am what am I doing here? <laughs> we're we're at Spano. What what happened? Okay. Get rid of the thug and the power jump near the I don't Power jump near the chum bucket. Power jump near the chum bucket? Is that just the literally do I just have to do that next to the chum bucket? You playing the infamous two evil and good demos on loop? Yeah, no, like that was like, that was like my, that was my whole shit. That was what I did. I had like a million demos that I just played over and over again. I, I only ever got like two full games digitally. I'm also pretty sure at one point, <laughs> I think at one point I accidentally, I accidentally spent like fifty dollars of my of my dad's money getting games that I thought I was just like getting because of like an exploit in the PS store. <laughs> I... <laughs> because because one time is that gonna? No, that's not. I don't know what they want me to do here. Super jump. Um. 
So like, yeah, so one time my little sister and I, power jump. Yeah, I don't know why they got all this new, well, I guess it is the chum bucket. Very nuclear sort of area. Um, oh, hello. Wait, what did it, it had a prompt for something. Anyway, um, one time, uh, if y'all if y'all know Fancy Pants Adventures, uh, Brad <laughs> said Brad Bird. What was his... what name? What's his name? It's the guy who made Fancy Pants. I know it. Anyway, um, he was really. He was releasing <laughs> Brad Pitt. They were releasing a console version of Fancy Pants Adventures. It was like really cool. Um, I, yeah, it's a really good game actually. I like I kind of I've I've considered like doing like a stream of it. I really I want to play it again. Um, but uh, they they did like a console version on PS3, and my little sister and I really wanted it, so I had the demo. And then I was like, oh, I was like, oh, I was like, hey, Dad, can you like get us like the full version of this game? It's only like twelve dollars. $15. He's like, yeah, sure. Um, and so, you know, he, he put in, like, his payment information on the, on the PlayStation Store, and we got the full game, right? And I was like, hell yeah. Later on down the road, it just so lines up that later on down the road, I discovered some sort of exploit. And there was a moment where I was like, huh, it's like letting me get these full games for demos that I have. And I'm pretty sure I ended up accidentally, without realizing it, using the payment information that was already in my PS3 from, like, my dad's card to purchase digital versions of Sly 2, Journey, <laughs> and, I, like, a couple other things. I don't know. I, th I, thought, I, I thought I was being sneaky. I thought I was being sneaky, but I think I was just being stupid. It's so funny. What do I... Oh, I did it. Oh! Oh, wait, no, these are... Oh, fuck, these are correspondent with the letters. Oh, you'll have to forgive me. My brain is not 100% here looking and thinking about this video game. Um, mm -mm. SpongeBob. Fix Patrick's antenna. Didn't we already... I don't know if we fixed it. I think we broke it, is what we did. Yeah, no, I'm scrambled egg like crazy tonight. I'm scrambled egg like crazy. How would one fix Patrick's antenna? Maybe I ought to... <laughs> Switch to a different costume. Or maybe can I talk to him. Whoa, oh, the TV is fixed. You saved me from thinking, SpongeBob. Me? Uh, oh my God, himbo goals. <laughs> okay. Um. Catch eight jellyfish. How many do we have? Did the track? How many we have? Oh, six. Okay, two more. Oh, yeah, I gotta sneak up to the green ones. Surely <laughs> that SpongeBob got that dumpy. It's a fucking fanny pack! <laughs> Hell yeah, it is. That fanny sure is packed. Yes, I did. I'm doing my best. <laughs> I'm doing my best. What do you want from me? You fucking... <laughs> you piece of shit. Get the fuck over here. God damn it. Okay. Last one. 
Last one. Get rid of, oh yeah, I gotta see, I don't, <laughs> don't like this one. He's just hanging out. What is, what, why, why are we doing this? Ghoul Lagoon bus stop. Oh yeah, it's like a, some shit. <laughs> How long has she been going for? An hour and six minutes. <laughs> if you believe it, if you believe it, this is not the result of some sort of marathon stream. Oh, God. How do I get rid of this guy? Can I just talk to him? Just like, hey, I don't know. Listen, dude, I don't know why I just work here, but like they're asking me to ask you to leave. You can talk to the you can talk to Mr. Craps and and he'll maybe explain it to you, but that's just what yeah, that's what I've been told to tell you. Bonk him? I don't want to bonk him. Hello, sir. I'm gonna have to ask you to leave, sir. Your aura is threatening all of the um, patrons in the building. Your crazy hair is really threatening to the family-friendly environment that we like to set here at the Crustus Crab. Sir, please stop breathing. Okay. <laughs> this visual effect on screen is actually the rush that SpongeBob gets when he murders somebody and he snuffs out a life. It's it's like a it's like a psychedelic to him. He's like, oh, turns out blood is actually a color that humans have never seen. Or sponges, I guess. What the fuck is going on? Okay. Okay. Um, shit. Uh, shit. What the fuck? Okay. Uh, I'll just put that down there, I guess. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, this is easy. This is easy peasy, actually. This is easy shit. I don't know why I was so worried. It's like literally, what? and turn in place to find a treasure. <laughs> what the fuck? It was like prompt me? Yes, okay. The divining rod. What the fuck? Oh. Oh, oh, it like turn like Oh, I see. Oh, I get it. Okay, so it's like a 
<laughs> it's like a hot, cold kind of thing. Because you're hot, you're cold, you're yes, you're no. You are- oh, there it is. I found one of the Dutchman treasures, surprisingly. Find all the- ew, what the fuck? did it. Rainbow Snake, thank you for the bits. Oh, God. Okay. Well, that's one episode down. One level conquered. Like, but ain't no bad fur day happening today. I've asked you, little varmint. The oh time God. <laughs> has come for you to join my ghostly crew. Shit, he got his no sparks all in my room. What Your the fuck? Your fate's been decided. Now looky here what I got for you. That's right. Watch the little sticky. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Gary, where are you, boy? Gary! Why did you take Gary? Not sure I agree, Mr. Dutchman. Mr. Dutchman. Why? 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 No one makes my best friends into pirates, and I mean no one. <laughs> you would have done You wouldn't steal a sponge. You wouldn't sponge a bob. No 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 More pants. This is, like, he definitely just shit his pants. Like... Chesty to make it to the restroom. <laughs> Nothing going on here. Is this the Dutchman's curse? You wouldn't download a download. <laughs> you would score a car. Downloading pirated movies is downloading pirated movies is downloading pirates. You wouldn't download a R pirates. I'm also pretty sure the original ads were, like, you wouldn't steal a car. Which, like, I don't know, I feel, I feel like it's just a false equivalency at that point. <laughs> so she said, yeah, I would. <laughs> Listen. Gulagoon bus stop. Do I just what do I, do I just wait? I sleep on the while I wait. Oh, tartar sauce! I still don't have the right ticket for this bus stop. Is that how? What? What the fuck? Put up! Put up! Put up! Put up! Put up! Put up! Between spider and man. This was the absolute first game I ever played and owned, and I didn't have a memory card, so I couldn't ever get past the second level. It was a Christmas gift. I was only five years old. It caused me psychological pain. I'm having Vietnam flashbacks. <laughs> Thank you for the donation. Yeah, it's a uh, co common thread, I guess, is just that uh, kids did not enjoy this video game. There we go. Look at it. This is like, this is like, I don't know why I'm spending so much time just kind of fucking around doing the not missions here, because what, what am I, what, 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 what? Find Patrick in downtown, visit Squidward at his house. Since when were you here? 
Hello, SpongeBob. So nice of you to finally join us. Squidward! Am I glad to see you. You won't believe what just happened to me and Gary. I don't have time for another one of your That's ridiculous weirdly tales. weirdly cheery. Mr. Krabs wants us to get to the Krusty Krab right away so he can tell us some important news. Important news? Maybe Mr. Why do you Krabs care, Squidward? <laughs> What are we waiting for? Um, can Take someone me. say you out of character? Away and I'll see you there when you're done. So that's how it is. Trying to hear the news before me, eh? Well, let's see who can get to the Oh, maybe he's first. maybe he's like tricking him. Yeah, sure. Whatever. Oh yeah, maybe he's yeah, yeah, maybe he's just Oh, wait. <laughs> Okay, this is actually really good. What the fuck? Okay, this is actually really fucking funny. I like that. Genuinely really good. Really good. Wow. There he goes. Is he gonna... <laughs> there he is! What if you let him win? Yeah, I feel, I feel like I'm not the first person to think of that, but... Or, obviously, I didn't think of that just now, but... I wouldn't be the first person to do it. Guys, I don't think Benny can win this one. I don't know, man. He's, he's a formidable foe. Yeah, if I just hold down L1, then I just stay in sneak mode. He hasn't even followed the road? Why would he? He's walking, he's not driving. Or boating, as it would be called in a SpongeBob lore. <laughs> he just waltzes in. Yeah, wow. Let's see. I think I got fudge in my pants. Like what he says in the. In the in the other game, the video game. You know the one? See, Mr. Krabs, I told you SpongeBob would show up eventually. I sure hope you're not mad about having to wait <laughs> because then someone might not be picked as your employee of the month. <laughs> yoo hoo uh, yay! Explain. Really, there was this accident and an earthquake and then this big whirlpool opened up above me. <laughs> Oh, please, Mr. Krabs, you've got to pick me for employee of the month. That's actually really good. All right, you two, step what, a sh what a shining little moment. I've got moment. some difficult news to tell you. Business has been very slow lately, so I'm going to shut down the Krusty Krab until it picks up again. Sh -sh shut down the Krusty Krab? I think I'm going to faint. You boys can hang around here or go home, but I can't pay you one way or the other. Sorry. Well, isn't that just great? I'm going home to think of some ways to pay the bills. So long, SpongeBob. <laughs> Cheer up, Mr. Krabs. You just laid me off. <laughs> so why is that my responsibility? Hey! Fuck you, you red piece of shit. What are, what are you doing in here? What are you doing? Jeepers, Mr. Krabs. Why do you think our business is so slow? No one seems interested in going out anymore. They think it's too much trouble to leave home. <laughs> too bad we can't move the Krusty Krab into their homes. SpongeBob, that's it. We'll do just that. Yeah. <laughs> you don't say. What is that? I can't, I can't oh, imagine any sort of relevance. Should I get a hammer? Never mind that. Nowadays. I'm going downtown to set things up. You take this bus ticket and meet me there as soon as you can. Oh my god, did this game predict Uber Eats? Uh... Yay! Okay, wasn't this a game about pirates? Yo, you'll see! Uh, uh, oh, ye of little faith. We just have to go downtown, you know. The bustling city where pirates flow like water.
Like, what else are they sail on? What are you doing about it? This game was the true inspiration for Death Stranding. Oh god. Don't make me unexcited to try Death Stranding whenever I get the chance. Where am I going? Downtown! That'll take me downtown! Great! We missed it! That's uh, from The Incredibles. Brad Bird's The Incredibles. Oh, Whoa! Dog Days Raid with a party 71. Hi! How's it going? How is the scary video games? I'm playing one of my own. So this is downtown Bikini Bottom. How will I ever find Mr. Krabs in such a huge place where the streets never end what and the, the buildings just go on and on and on? Yoo-hoo! SpongeBob over it's here! like a bad Muppet. Oh, shit! Whoa! Ha, ha, nice. Thank you so much, old man Henderson. I appreciate it. You know... The elderly aren't so bad nowadays. <laughs> um, by the way, by the way, I was talking at the beginning of the stream about, um, there's a level in this game that I remember giving me, like, an actual, like, weird sense of, like, existential dread. Like, like, a sort of, like, r like, sense of, like, being lost as a kid. Uh, this is that level, I think. If I remember correctly. Glad you finally made it, lad. Between you and me and this here cart, there's no stopping us now. Just what exactly is your plan, Mr. Krabs? It's just like you said, SpongeBob. If no one wants to leave home, then we bring the Krusty Krab to them. <laughs> I'm talking about food delivery. I'll put out a bag filled with patties whenever enough orders come I call in. it DoorDash. We'll the bag and get to all our customers before it's too late. There might even be some tip money in it for you. This sounds like fun, Mr. Krabs. Great. This delivery is to a single location. I call it post meaties Go to Seashell Street, then look for the 17 on the building, then drop off the food at the door. Our food is very popular, so watch out for rough characters who might try to take it from you. Now go to it, lad. Let's see, we got we got post meaties Crub Hub. Deliver food to 17 Seashell Street. Okay. Oh my god, do I actually have to, like... I'm actually just delivering food. Like, really just navigating the city streets to deliver food. Oh no, get the fuck away from me. You can't have this shit! You strike me as someone who probably has a peanut allergy. Ha ha ha, let me tell ya. Cashews all in this bitch. Where's 17? I don't know how to navigate a city. Who the fuck do you take me for? Somebody who ever goes anywhere? Oh, Jesus. Oh my god, it's like actually like... The oh, I understand. It's the actual fucking like... Like, dread of being in a, being in a city and not knowing where to go and not knowing anybody. Ugh! Having a... <laughs> Running into strangers. You don't know anyone's intentions. You don't know where you are. You don't know where you'll end up. All you know, you got something that they want. <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is just like the game Joy played. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what was she playing again? delivery <laughs> so fucking that's actually so funny god i'm gonna fucking kill you get back here let's cut him off cut him off shit all right leap <laughs> fuck you haha <laughs> <laughs> You won't know the power of my special attack! 
Is this a new opponent? Time to send you into next week! Oh, wow. <laughs> shit! Okay. Alright, well. Is there a map? Oh, I found 17 Seashell Street. I just gotta backtrack. Mr. Krabs, where the fuck are you? Is that... I thought that was like Dora up there for a second. Oh my god! Yeah, this is the <laughs> second level! Who the hell are you?! Larry. Okay, um... I... Oh my god, this is seriously, like... This is horrifying. I don't know how to hint- There he is! I forgot where I'm going. Oh god. Um... I literally forgot. Oh, seashell. There it is. Okay. No, there was a Dora- There was a Dora picture. Oh, there it is! Fuck away from me. Get the fuck away. Just stay back. Just stay back. Everybody, just leave me alone. Seriously, I don't want- I don't want anybody to consider me. I do not want to be considered, and I will not consider in return. If we can have this social agreement with, an, with one another, we can both survive the night. Oh. Please, for the love of God, do not perceive me. Please, for the love of God, do not perceive me. Here. This is yours, sir. I got a tip. Wow. Five little smackaroons. It's really gonna make a difference. <laughs> I just missed the irony of me saying that when uh, very frequently people do actually tip five dollars to my stream. <laughs> Um, it makes a difference then. <laughs> I'm ready for the next delivery, Mr. Krabs. This delivery is a little trickier. There's a building under construction nearby, and it's full of very hungry workers. The streamer means the donors. No! I gotta get to- why are you leaving the fucking truck here? This is not a truck. Oh my god, okay. Well, off I go. Loading. <laughs> but it looks good on you, Spongebob. <laughs> Tipping five dollars, that's not a good look. Oh, but it looks great on you, Twitch chat. <laughs> oh my god. Oh man, that's funny. <laughs> Thank you so much for the bits. Some of the other workers might try to take the food from you. Order up. It was just this town is just riddled with like thievery and like assault, I guess. This game is going to blow up my PS2. This I am going to have I'm going to have a like real I might have a fire complaint <laughs> by the time this is over. I'm gonna have a fire to complain about. This is gonna blow up my PS2 and set my apartment on fire. Where's the foreman? What does a foreman look like? I blocked out all the memories of hanging out with my dad at the construction site. I don't, I don't remember what the head guy looks like. What the fuck? Interesting night, Patrick. 
Yep, just on the job. Okay. He's making ends meet. He's doing what he's gotta do. But he's there's no way he's the form. He wouldn't be just like right in the middle, right? Oh no, is he the foreman? As in, Patrick, are you the foreman? Nope. Halt, villain! Don't try to get away. For I am Barnacle Boy, Super Sidekick. You really had me going there for a minute, Patrick. Where did you get that great costume? I mailed in 450 kelp bar wrappers and got both official costumes from the mermaid. I don't care. 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 Well, he took my food. I don't know if that's... Was he the foreman? I don't think so. Well, but now I have the Mermaid Man costume, so... But I still have to deliver food to the construction foreman. I just... I'm, I'm wasting our product. I can't... <laughs> my PS2 is not... Okay, I'll change into the uh, Mermaid Man Let's see. Whoa. ACDC? Is that you? Okay. All right. This is... I harass this man into the ether. Oh shit! I can multitask. Wow. SpongeBob really is a girl boss queen. No, I'm sorry. I'm. I. You know, there's. Only so much I can get away with before I have to fucking live up to, and, and you know, like, atone for... I said queen! I didn't... <laughs> no, I didn't call Spongebob a girl boss queen. <laughs> I'm queer, and I'm ready to gaslight and cape keep. Like I have a headache right now. Fuck. Why are you? This violates every. Oh. Hello, sir. I didn't. Well, like I was saying. Fuck you. This this whole site violates every. <laughs> uh, fuck. There's like so many OSHA violations, right? Like across the board. the foreman. You just order a burger with no mouth? You don't know. You don't know. 
Listen, chat, what do we keep coming back to? Wow. Fuck yeah! This game is an interactive slideshow. I can't... I gotta do... I gotta use the jellyfish. Okay. Mr. Krabs, what do you fucking want from me now? I'm... I'm done. I'm, I'm done with this. What do you want? The other foreman?! <laughs> foreman 2! Where the fuck is the second guy? Hello? Not in there. I, you know, my energy does not match how this game clearly wants me to feel wearing this costume right now. Where is the other guy? Move something heavy onto the pressure plate. Just fucking punch the burgers out of existence. Huh? Oh, I see. Look at how slow we move. Ah! No, I, I, I don't think it's the guy I killed earlier. I would hope not. It's like, is it like, like Morrowind or Oblivion where you can just like kill plot important NPCs, soft lock your game? Moral choice in SpongeBob games. Moral choice in video games. Oh. Okay. Um, I was telling me there was another guy behind there. Since I don't give a shit about this game, I'll... I'll just let it be. Why is the food heavy enough that we just, like... are not going at any speed whatsoever? Actually, okay, this is fine. If we jump, it's fine. I don't know why this level is so laggy. It's funny. Well, I mean, clearly... Oh, hey. Look at that. Uh, I mean, clearly, like, this is a very, this is a very rushed game. Clearly not a lot of time to optimize. <laughs> Say clearly, like, I'm speaking within, like, oh, I have, like, a sophisticated palette for video games and the, the state of development Another there within. delicious Krabby Patties served up hot. Who wants a slice of this cakewalk now? This delivery won't Shut be up! Hard. Three different parties called from the high-rise apartments. High-rise apartments, okay. Oh, God. Okay. How has it not been even, like, an hour and 15 minutes yet? <laughs> like, we've been going for an hour and 40. I feel like I've been playing this game for three hours. <laughs> Mr. Krabs just fucking running off stream was strangely funny to me. I gotta get out of here! Fuck you! <gasps> Finally, I can retaliate with violence! Okay. High rise apartments. Where the hell? Okay. 
watch this game feels unreal. Um, I don't know if it would have been developed in Unreal. <laughs> Was Unreal even out at the time? <laughs> Super Mario and Unreal Engine 5. Sonic the Hedgehog in Unreal Engine 4. SpongeBob SquarePants in Unreal Engine 4. Nickelodeon hire this man. Nin <laughs> Nintendo hire this man. Mr. Krabs, hire this man! What the fuck did I just watch? I think I maybe know where the apartments are. I think it's on the other side of this, this area, that little gate. Remember this game crashing for me at the pier level? I thought you said Pixar level, and I was like... I, like, my eyes, like, glazed over, and I read that as Pixar level, and I was like, what the fuck? Oh. Oh, no, we're just here. Anyway, I was like, what is this, like, a weird, like, Pixar level? It's just, like, Secret Kingdom Hearts 4? Revenge of the Flying Dutchman? Whoa. Whoa. So, I've had a couple and people in chat talk about how Make sure the development of this game family. was apparently, like, Good truly luck. disastrous. And I'm thinking I want to take a look at that at, at a certain point. So I guess remind me if I don't remember. Because I'm very interested. Wait a second. Well, first of all, we're naked now, so that's fun. Also, wait a second. We, the Krusty Krab was shut down because people weren't coming to the restaurant. Mr. Krab specifically says, don't stay here because I can't pay you. So what the fuck is he doing with SpongeBob right now? Is this just volunteer work? Is he not paying us for this shit? You know, Mr. Krabs, disappointed but not surprised. Disappointed but not surprised. Do you want food again? I know which fucking apartment to live to. Right, the one down right at the bottom. It's an apartment in hell. Beelzebub wants his fucking fish tacos. God damn it. Yes, fish tacos. Fish tacos are a fucking thing, y'all. Don't do this to me. <laughs> Don't do this to me. Don't show your hand. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah. No, they are in the ocean. Listen, I'm, I'm looking at a sponge. I'm not thinking about fish. No, you're right. You're right. You're right. That was my bad. I didn't see the truth right in front of me. I saw people say, what, fish tacos? And I was like, yeah, what the fuck? What do you, what do you mean? Fish tacos, I said what I said. But now I'm sitting here thinking, oh wait, 
the truth really was right in front of me. Um, it seems there was a scandal under my nose that I just didn't. Apartment one. Okay. <laughs> he avails the moral choice of bikini bottom. It's like a high rise apartments is like a Yule Moore situation. Like, oh, man. oh wait, I maybe shouldn't. <laughs> maybe shouldn't spoil that. <laughs> I was about to do Shadowbringer spoilers, but I won't. I'll refrain. Wahoo! Triumphant free labor! Ah! I just need a few more sand dollars, and then maybe I can get Sandy a gift. Damn, even well, after I skipped all those dreams, I know. <laughs> I'm sorry, Alex. called in from this neighborhood. The way he just leaves on the guitar riff is actually very funny. All right, business district. Where is that? Oh, man. Camera so jank here. Yeah, I mean, it was uncontrollable in more ways than one. I physically can't move it, and also, man, it's wacky. <laughs> When's the Flying Dutchman com gonna come back? Oh, ye of little faith, don't you know? This game has a vision. It's a slow burn, but it really pays off. <laughs> business district. This is a business district? Huh. I never, I never think about Bikini Bottom as like a place with like a lot of like business, you know, like cubicle, office, like white collar business. I guess it's a whole city. I don't know why I'm surprised by that. I'm just like, y'all got like offices and shit? What the fuck? Well, I guess there is that one montage of the dude like, living a very <laughs> unfulfilled life. <laughs> yes, dear. Where am I? Is it, am I going back to the, the one setup that we already had? Not that I know where that is off the top of my head. I'm just going to be looking around for it anyway, so why do I even care? Just swinging it. <laughs> Don't mind me, sir. Just minding my own business. Caught on camera. What the fuck? Where am I going? <laughs> he just, <laughs> just you. What if you just knew a guy that would go out on the town and get in fights with like wild and or otherwise like primal animals in in like a back alleys? What would you do in that situation? I'd do that. You'd, you'd square up. You'd square up with the with the with the best of them and the first of them. I feel like I could take five feral cats easy. I don't know about that. I feel like that's a that's a pretty big claim. Where the fuck am I going? I I I I don't I'm not confident I could take even one cat that's like full on like beast mode, you know? 
Like, even, like, a small one. I feel like I'd be, like, I'd be overpowered really easy. Because, like, I don't, I don't have claws. I chew my nails like crazy. Like, I don't... I got nothing. Okay, it's gotta be the other way. Literally, it was right here. Hey, bud. Your first destination is We're still Avatars doing this. Avenue. I saw someone else. It's not like, like a delivery boy. So three times careful. thing. Hurry up, lad! Time's running out. Eighty-eight Albatross Street. The fuck are these street names? Shitty ones. I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Albatross Avenue, sorry, that's my bad. Oh, this is it. Oh shit, you're right, there is a time limit, what the fuck? Ugh. Why do we move so slow? rest we don't get a moment of respite not even a singular solitary moment oh god it's still going oh jesus okay this is like a marathon what the fuck is an albatross in the context of spongebob i don't know what is a god to a king <laughs> the other way around um what's a non-believer to a uh uh, God. <laughs> uh, an asshole. <laughs> I'm gonna be real. Totally forgot where I'm delivering to. 24 She Shell Street. Thank you so much. She Shell. Sally Shell Seashells by the seashore. SpongeBob serves silly soups by the Seashell Street. I already forgot again. Where? 24? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> 24. Oh my god, you, you're kidding me. I mean, when I play Portal Seashell. <laughs> well, it's a first person game, so you wouldn't Seashell at all, would you? <laughs> check, check fucking mate, atheist. way I wouldn't I wouldn't want to live on a street that's like denoted by thunderstorms you know like because it just makes me think like is that what you're known for like do you just have like horrible like storm resistant infrastructure or whatever like do you like is like I don't know what it is like do you just get frequent like lightning in this area I don't know Eleven seashell again with Seashell Street. I'm so sick of the same old places. I want to see bigger. I want to see better. I want to go to New York. I want to go to New York, Dad. I want to see the lights. I want to have those nights. What is up with the? Patrick, what the fuck are you doing? Patrick, are you in a cult? Here's your food. Thanks. Patrick, did you just deliver food to my customer? Are you working for Thanks, the chum Bob. bucket? Are you delivering food for Mr. Krabs too? Patrick, I am the only one delivering food for Mr. Krabs. Now tell me what you're doing here. You think you're the only one who can be a delivery boy? Well, I have a job now, too. And it's not my fault that you're slower than me. What do you mean, Mr. So Krabs? You're wearing plankton-branded shit. Mr. Krabs would have told me if he hired someone else. No, there's Are they not fucking looking? Going on here, and <laughs> I'm gonna find out who's behind it. Plankton! <laughs> you piece of shit! Plankton! <laughs> Patrick is gatekeeping.
and he can't hear you. If I yell loud enough, I will feel like he can, and I feel like nice I've done my work, part. SpongeBob. Anything that doesn't happen past that point is due to ignorance day. and complacency uh, on his Mr. own Krabs, part. If I've contributed, and if I've done my boy. due diligence, be crazy, I'm lad. in the right. Why would I hire someone else when I can make you do all the work for nothing? But I'll tell you, if someone was huh? into my business, I'd follow oh, him just until I found confirm. out what was really going on. What a piece of shit. Follow him, huh? That's not such a bad idea. Just make sure you don't get too close or they'll see that you're following them. Anyhow, I'm gonna pack up this stuff soon and head on home. Thanks for all your help, lad. Yeah, cause thanks is gonna pay the bills. Okay, uh, follow Patrick. I gotta stalk my friend. Just looking for him now. I have like superpowers now, though, so that's fine. I'll just be able to just wham! Wham! <gasps> sorry, sir. Oh, fuck. I'm sorry, sir. Collateral damage. This music is about to get on my last nerve. <laughs> I hear the music. I hear the music. Oh god, what are you? Who are you? I hear the music. Well, back where he started. What the hell? I guess the back alley is like where the shortcuts are. I gotta fuck. I gotta. I gotta do something about this. All right. Well, it's this one again. At least it's just like a little bit more pleasant, you know? At least for the moment. <laughs> God, this just killed me. <sighs> this soundscape? would drive anyone insane. Just listen. <laughs> like, this is just... It's just unbearable. This is like why... Is, is this is why parents don't like listening to video games. <laughs> <laughs> I think I understand now. It's the boots. Yeah. Yeah, quite literally. I... What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I find the judgment's treasure. I find the treasure. I deliver food to Patrick. Is that it? Oh, oh, follow Patrick in Bikini Bottom. Okay, I have to go back. All right. It's been two hours, I wanna look at the torture development of this game. Not quite yet. I think I want that to be like my closer, and I'm not I'm not quite done here yet. I was hoping this game was was short enough that I could beat it in one sitting today. Cause I didn't want to start another series. 
I was like, that's that's anti that that's not at all. That's like opposite of constructive to the issues I'm having right now. There's no better feeling than having a full stomach and me pockets loaded with money. And you now just nice said you could nap in the office. If it's a long nap you desire, get him. I get him, bitch. You. Get him, bitch. Do it. Well, step right inside. Place your order. You got the wrong idea, crustacean. Just look upon this little treasure and let yourself rest. That's right. Sleep. I hold no fear towards this outcome. Why is the Dutchman stealing everyone but SpongeBob? It's a it's a way of torture. He's stealing all his loved ones. He's making him truly alone in this cold world. You know? Luke, there goes your delivery rival. <laughs> now is your chance now, to find out now who is kill behind him. this. <laughs> Don't let him get away this time. Don't let him get away. Eternally. Jesus Christ, okay. Dude, what the fuck? Hey, can you like stop? Can, like, we're like best friends. Can we talk about this? Hi. You will have to be more careful if huh? you don't want him to see you. Don't let him out of your sight. What? I'm but supposed to be sneaking? We're not just gonna like talk about this? Okay. I'll just hang out. You do your thing, bud. Yep, just kind of... You just went, like, in circles. What are you doing? I, I can't move the camera down, which is really unfortunate. Where are you going? Where are you going? This is not any sort of route. This is just... What the fuck are you... What is happening? I can't see. I can't see anything. I can't move the camera up and I can't see anything. Who's he? What are you doing, man? If only he knew how I feel. If only he knew how I feel. This is literally, yeah, literally the exact definition of he's, he's standing there menacingly. What the fuck? Oh, it's the robot crabs, really? I'm sorry, Mr. Krabs, but all those people who ordered food told me they already got it. Fool! Worthless lackey! Uh, I mean, that's okay. Others this is not... In their orders, He's sitting right there! To intercept their calls. Aha! He's over I there! I scheme now, Mr. Krabs. It's all too clear that you're the one who's been trying to put the Krusty Krab out of business. Uh, uh, hi, SpongeBob. Are you a worthless lackey, too? Now I'm really Unfortunately. <laughs> Why would Mr. Krabs try to put himself out of business? Because he's a worthless lackey? Enough! Enough! Patrick just like Silence, a kid that will bones. repeat anything he hears regardless of what it means. Plankton! Plankton? Of course, you nattering nincompoops. Who else has the intellect to mastermind such a plan? I would have succeeded too if it weren't for your utter incompetence. Does this mean I don't get that raise? Let's face it, Plankton. Huh? Evil does not pay or even get very good tips. Your days of impersonating Mr. Krabs are over. You may have won that round, SpongeBob, but I don't need a disguise to separate your crabby boss from his fortune. Behold, the greatest attraction to ever appear in Bikini Bottom, Chum World. Hey, everyone will spend so much money here, they won't have any left to buy your pathetic Krabby Patties. 
No, I'm off well, to I... jellyfish fields to watch the invertebrates get tangled in nets of torture. Ta-ta! I... I hate to admit it, but that chum world looks kind of fun. What's the thread no, here? Fun. Where did Plankton? So I just realized going? I'm like I'm I'm like crushing uh, a water bottle in my hand. Idly. Just... Okay. Chum world. Didn't we have one more talk to Squidward thing? I'm gonna go do that. I need an energy shift here. to crush a water bottle in quiet rage kind of game. I, so I've been like actively trying to like drink more water. So I like, I, I, I just put like a bunch of water bottles in, in a mini fridge outside and I've just been, you know, just like working my way through them. The problem though is that I like fuck with things idly when I don't have anything else to do with like my hands. Um, it's empty water bottles are a problem for me because they're so fun to just like, you know? And like literally like earlier today, I was on call with, with Joy and um, I'm sitting there, I'm just kind of doing my thing. And she says to me, she says to me, are you chewing on a water bottle? And I'm like, huh? And I look in my hands and in my hands, I actually still have it here. It's a water bottle. It's empty. The entire label is ripped off. Like, in its entirety. The label is ripped off and stuffed inside of it. And it's... And the bottle is flattened. In, like, entire... It's, like, flat. Like, I've, like, evenly flattened it out. And I was sitting there doing that... For I don't know how long... And I didn't even <laughs> realize that's what's happening. So, it's a trade-off, you know? Like, I'm gonna be healthier because I'm drinking more water, but also, I'm gonna be making, <laughs> I'm just gonna be, I'm gonna be fidgeting with these water bottles in ways that I don't even, like, realize I'm doing. Hey, Squidward, what's with all the stuff on your lawn? A squid has to pay his rent somehow, so I'm having a little yard sale to make a few extra sand dollars. Now leave me alone so I can read my book. What you reading? It's called How Use to a glass. Evil I can't. Spirits, okay. Now please. Let I me I can't put in the effort to prepare glasses of water for myself. Can I please borrow your books? For I I'm, I'm skipping. I I I can't put in the effort to prepare glasses of water for myself. I can't do it. Not like consistently. I like, I can't like, I, like I got, I literally right next to me, I showed this on stream at one point. I have a water bottle, like it has like a filter in it and everything. And I bought this for money. Cause I was like, I'm going to use this to drink more water. And I was like, all I gotta do is refill it. Hell yeah. And it's got like a filter. I don't have to worry about it tasting gross. Like that's awesome. I have not filled this thing in like a month. At least, I can't do it. Like, uh, like it, like I have to. Like, it has to be, like, water bottles that I like chill, and I like have in the fridge for me. Like, until I get something figured out with like the way my brain works, I can't like prepare water. <laughs> like, like it, that sounds stupid, but you know what I mean. I can't like I can't go out of my way to like fill something up with water that isn't already like that. Like it, like it has to be something I can just grab and have. Otherwise I'm not going to drink water. <laughs> like that's literally like it's, it's, it's either, it's either it's there and I can just take it and it's ready or I'm not going to drink water. <laughs> it's like my, I, my brain doesn't work any other way. Borrow Squid's book. Do I just, I steal it? I don't, I don't care. I'm going to Jellyfish Fields, I think. Oh, tartar sauce. I... No, it was, what, where is the... Freedom... Chum World. Is that different from Jellyfish Fields? down 
downtown. Chum World, there we go. I thought Chum World was Jellyfish Fields for some reason. I guess maybe it is still and they're just... Oh, what? I don't have the... I can't go to Chum World? Okay. Meow. <laughs> the way I'm fucking just... Wah! <laughs> R3, okay. All right. Get Chum World Pass from Jellyfish Fields. Okay. But then how do I get to Jellyfish Fields? I didn't have... I couldn't... I guess I have to do other things before that. I'm gonna go back to Squidward. You know what, how does Plankton have the money to build a whole ass theme park if no one likes his food? He went to college! Squidward, this big acorn sure is making a weird buzzing noise. Acorn? You mean that hive I got from my cousin on the coast? No, I mean this big buzzing acorn in the glass case. I bet Sandy would really like this. The coast oh, of yeah. what? I bet your little squirrel friend would really <laughs> like that <laughs> Wait a second. Acorn. What's what a coast to them? For? They're already Name in the ocean. The price, yard merchant. I'll sell it to you for 200 sand dollars. <laughs> Start saving your tip money. <laughs> I mean, 200 sand dollars? Okay. I really need that book to save Gary. You must sneak up on. <laughs> okay. I'm ready to buy this <laughs> acorn now, Stop! Stop! I'm gonna fucking well, go well. insane! I'm gonna go insane! I'm gonna go insane! Oh! Okay. <laughs> Let me sneak around him. I'm gonna lose my mind. What is this? Treatum? That seems blocked. Oh. I love How stealing. To defeat evil spirits. Chapter 8. The Flying Dutchman. Any poor soul who awakens the Dutchman must suffer his revenge for all eternity. Revenge. <laughs> the only defense revenge. against the Dutchman's magical powers are his most personal treasures. These are items which he carried close to him while he was alive. Now... Find all seven this voice the for the French narrator is not good, down the but as an audiobook narrator, <laughs> yeah, literally, That's Monica, it. All Monica, I had to do same thought, audible.com. of the Dutchman to end this once and for all. Barnacles, I thought this would be a challenge. <laughs> no, no words about. There we go. Oh, Sandy, here she comes. Fuck yeah. Hey, Sandy, what's up? Oh, she's so cute. Look at her. She has a real. It's, it's, her character model's really cute. Oh. Okay. Let's go. Look at her. <laughs> she's. She's looking pretty sus, though. It's almost like we have an imposter among us. Sandy! Boy, am I glad to see you! You won't believe what happened to me and Gary this morning. Let me guess. Curiosity got the best of you again? Yeah, I guess you could say that. Well, don't you fret, little varmint. This squirrel knows just the thing to cheer you up. A good old-fashioned karate match. Just step into my arena when you're good and ready. I'm so... <laughs> Can you take the acorn? Can you take the acorn? Let's bring this to you. You think you're up for a karate match with a real pro? I might have the time to show you a thing or two. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, sure. You know what? 
That's fine. We'll we'll take this. Let's take this in there. Can't can't say collateral damage won't happen, but that's uh that's just you know the risk of the risk of the job. I don't know what I'm saying. I'm I'm just I'm just sending out word word soup right now just to get any sort of commentary going. Gatekeep Gaslight Texas. What the fuck? He's so mad. Oh, oh shit. I remember this. This like move set, I remember very specifically. Okay, now listen up, because I'm gonna remind you how this all works. We've got a short amount of time to right. up all this junk in your yard. The person who breaks the most stuff when the time runs out is the winner. Just tell me which moves are Oh, legal. I remember this. You... I'll teach you a few moves. You can press the action button. To... Ready? Okay. Oh, shit. Wow. I do I remember this so specifically. Ow. Ow. I, I, I like the very clearly like reused like treasure chest models. Like, oh, the, these are all the Dutchman treasures right here. We found them. We don't even need to play the rest of the game. They're all right here. I'm just submitting her repeatedly. I'm sorry, Sandy. You just gotta get out of the way, maybe. Why do we have a kick move? It's really not like... It's not gonna be doing much, I don't, I don't think. Let's see, I wonder who's gonna win. Where, you know, it's really neck and neck right now. Penny is hurting innocent karate squirrel. I guess never meet your heroes. <laughs> well, I never said I was perfect. But I did say I was splurfect. I don't know. Sandy's referred to as foe. I gotta admit, SpongeBob, <laughs> that was some tussle. You did okay for a sea critter. Oh, you weren't so bad for a land critter. <sighs> that oh, damn, this beef is coming back. Me. I thought I'm we squashed this decades ago. Why don't you drop on by my tree dome and pay a visit, okay? That was sure swell of Sandy to cheer me up. I wish I could do something special for her. Look at her little strut. She's like, uh, I know. Uh, oh, she I'll means give her business. A present. But what would Sandy like? Oh, oh. The acorn. It's all coming together. We sequence broke. We sequence break to this video game. We sequence break to this video game. I just smash the glass. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Let me ask you something, SpongeBob. Do you bleed? Whoa, fuck. Uh, <laughs> I can't believe I just watched Penny Snap Q. Parker brutally murder Sandy Cheeks live on stream. How could you? You monster. What can I say? I just don't. I don't. I don't, feel as dry as I, usually I don't follow the things that PC culture want me to do the to suppress myself. Okay. Wait, I'm still trying to deliver you your gift. They just yeah, they just don't what care about the in helmet here, in this Sandy? one. I got all fired up after That's our fine. karate match and wanted to practice some more, but I guess I got carried away because I accidentally poked some holes in the dome. This place is filling up faster than eleven. Holy shit, she's got like strong hands. hands. What can I do to help? See if you can find something to plug the holes in the dome. You've got to plug all the holes to stop the water from coming in. Just uh, plugging multiple holes in, like, the, I assume, like, 
like a military grade reinforced dome. There's no time to dilly dally. Will you what? Will you take my fucking gift, please? At the very least, I came all this way. Ah. Uh. <laughs> I remember this too. I remember this. Oh yeah, I can't like. I gotta. You gotta like aim it. Why? This is so weird. I, 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 I will say I do remember weirdly enjoying this part. Like, I don't know what it was, but like plugging the holes with acorns is like weirdly satisfying. Am I the only one who like played this game and felt that way? There's like a stark contrast to the way that I felt about the downtown bikini bottom level. It's so, like this is like a moment of respite. Fuck. Oh, I probably gotta jump. Yeah. Oh, yeah, and I remember this wheel. This, uh, this wheel is a lot bigger than it is in, in uh, Battle for Bikini Bottom. How come he's not dehydrating? Uh, since when do we care about the SpongeBob lore here? Come on, guys. Just did that out of order. This game terrified me as a child. That's so funny to me. Was it just like... Is it just like the general aura this game had? Or did, did everyone else also have like specific areas of the game where like just gave you, like, a horrible, like, pit-in-the-stomach kind of feeling. I'm genuinely curious. Like, it, like is it just the general aura? Or, like... Because, like, for me, I think the, spe the specific bit was uh, downtown, and then the rest of it does kind of have, like, a weird vibe, but, like... It's, like, hard to pinpoint unless I'm in that level. Backroom vibes, yeah. This <laughs> SpongeBob Revenge of the Flying Dutchman is is the liminal space of SpongeBob video games. It's very funny. That's very that's that's a very interesting way to think about it. Battle for Bikini Bottom is like the fucking like Disney World of SpongeBob games, and then this is like the like the backroom like like abandoned office liminal space. Can you look at that flower patch really quick? Yeah, sure. This one? Oh shit, it looks like a gun. Oh shit, it's gun-shaped. The fuck? Bam, bam, bam! Listen, chat, if y'all are seeing something else, then I don't know how to help you there. It really just says more about you than it does... than it does me, I think. <laughs> it looks like a pistol! Wow, this one sucks. Fuck. Oh my god. Is it always just like, is it just gonna go higher like a group? Oh shit, look at that! Look at that! Hell yeah. Clutch. I fucking no scoped it like crazy, bro. Oh, 
Damn, put Penny in Space Jam 3. No, thank you. <laughs> no, thank you. I watched like half of Space Jam 2 and I just, I, I found it genuinely hard to stomach. Fuck. I just got the angle right on that. Red time rewatching Looney Tunes back in action. Looney Tunes back in action is like all of the things that Space Jam 2 was trying to do except done actually well. Arguably. Madagascar PS2 game was great. I don't know where this is coming from, but also, I, I last time, um, uh, last time Joy was over, we were trying to figure out something to stream from my end, and um, I was like, oh, I'll just put in, uh, I don't know, like a Madagascar for the PS2. I was like, I got this copy of Madagascar from the PS2 a while back. Um, um, and I, we looked at the disc, and it was like, it, it, it like was weirdly colored in the back. Like it didn't look like a standard PS2 disc. I think it was like blue. And I was like, "Huh, that's weird." And when I tried to put it in, I, I would put it in and turn it on, and it would, you know, the PS2 would go like. And then it would go... So I was like, okay. Uh, can't play this one. Can't play that game. We done? Mission accomplished! All the holes are plugged! Thanks, SpongeBob. You're a real lifesaver. This place will probably stay soaked for days. As for me, I'm going upstairs to dry off. Are you gonna accept my gift? I've been sitting here trying to give you this fucking acorn for like the past a million years. Tarnation. <laughs> All those holes in my dome made this place wetter inside than out. I could sure use something special. Oh, that's why he doesn't need the, the thing. It's already covered in water. Please accept my gift. Hey there, SpongeBob. Back so soon? What you got there? Yes. Well, I, I just thought you might like this. It's a Aww. really weird acorn that makes funny noises when you shake it. Maybe you can use it as a decoration for your tree. <laughs> Why, isn't this the fanciest doohickey you ever done saw? This will look great on top Does of my tree. she not know? Hold on a sec while I put it up there. Oh no, she doesn't know. Oh no. SpongeBob! This is no acorn! Get up here right away! Sandy, how do you not know? I would like to, uh... Get this. Get back on the wheel. <laughs> what the fuck? Run on the what? <laughs> oh, I... <laughs> Get back on the wheel! <laughs> okay. Hold on. I'm gonna explore for a second. Whee! Shit. Oh! If I time this right, does it... No, I think it literally is just... Yeah, do the normal jump bonus. I, uh, there we go. Running on the wheel! Running on the wheel! Spongebob, do the shit drawer step. <laughs> okay. Crowd favorite. 
fuck I was just fell off. Oh shit! Ah! That is not right. That is not right. That is not fair or correct. Ah! Get back on the wheel. <laughs> what if the what if the uh, the French narrator voice came in? Get back on the wheel, SpongeBob. I'm trying my best. Your best will not be good enough at Hades' doorstep. Fuck! I spend while still watching streams the MCU game marathon, but I'm on a hiatus right now. Um, sorry, I mumbled that so much. Has the MCU game marathon been on indefinite hiatus right now? Not officially, but also, um, I basically, I've been burning the candle at both ends for like the past couple weeks. Um, and you know, to be entirely honest, I don't have much to show for it. Uh, but I am more tired possibly than I've been in like, five to six months um so i have just been streaming whatever is like even remotely interesting for me to stream that can just like get me to press the broadcast button and like do my job um because i need to you know uh i am going to be taking a break at the beginning of august uh so first couple weeks of august i'm gonna be taking a break and um going uh going out of state to, to visit my girlfriend for a couple weeks. And then, uh, yeah, I w so I won't be streaming during those couple weeks. When I get back, um, you know, a lot of things are gonna hopefully be a little bit more structured again, and uh, I'll get back to some things that I've left going. Right now, yeah, right now I'm literally just trying to make ends meet with like whatever can fucking get me to, to, to turn, turn the stream on and do anything at all. Which is why the last three streams were like Final Fantasy streams, which like I've I've really gotten back into recently. Um, and uh, yeah, otherwise I've I've mainly just been um, extremely exhausted, like 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 unbelievably exhausted right now. <laughs> I would watch a stream and just you crushing water bottles. Don't don't tempt me. Don't tempt me. That sounds like just the kind of thing that like be crazy enough to work. Okay, I gotta get in there. Terrible games always make you think this will be a good laugh to play. It'll be so bad it's good. Then you actually do it in the realization you have to play this god awful game in its entirety dawns upon you. I've really been struggling to to like motivate myself to get back to Hulk. I gotta be real. That first stream it started off pretty funny. I was so, so sick of that game by the end of it. And we're not even, like, in it. Like, there's so much of that game left, and I don't want to play any of it. <laughs> I'm dead! Bye, SpongeBob! Okay. What's up, Sandy? What seems to be the problem, Sandy? Nah. <laughs> That acorn you gave me is nothing more than a hive filled with angry bees and wasps. Now someone has to get to the top of the tree and get it down. Let me guess. That someone is bright yellow and kind of square. Okay, I'll see what I can do to get the hive bees out of Bees and tree. wasps in the oh. same hive? What the fuck? Nature is insane. That hive isn't moving. Oh, what the fuck? I'm going. Ew. Ew, what is this, sap? Sandy, why do you have sap leaking out of your house? Yeah, these bees are kind of just chilling. 
They're not they're not doing a whole lot here. <laughs> yeah, they're really cute low poly bees. They're actually like little babies. They're just hanging out. Look at it! That's actually really cute. That's just a funny little guy. You know, Sandy, maybe if you weren't so scared of change. <laughs> why do you have- why is your stinger on your, like, nose? Oh, there it is. Waha! Oh, goodbye. Sandy, I die for you! I put my so, um, life on the no line feelings. for your right. whim, Sandy. That's a good start, but now I've got all these stinging varmints flying around in here. Round them all up. If you do a good job, I might even have a reward for you. You're really close to the mic there. Round them up. If you do a good job. You gotta round up the bees. Okay, let me change into my bee costume. Fuck! Goodbye, Sandy. <laughs> uh. Aw, thanks, loves! Feels like it's been ages since I've been able to catch a stream, but wanted to swing by and say <laughs> hi. Since I saw you playing a game I grew up with. Hope you're having a lovely day. Thank you, Whitmer. Hi, I really appreciate that. Thanks for dropping by. And thank you for the very generous donation as well. No, it's time for fishing gear. It's time to catch some bee bastards. Catch nine bees or wasps. What's the difference? I, I haven't seen, like... I don't think I've seen an alternate model. <laughs> Those bees and tis a beasts. Yeah, <laughs> this game isn't even sure which ones these are. <laughs> catch nine uh, bees or whatever the fuck are they wasps? I don't know. You just catch them though. We put these fucking we put these hit boxes here for you to interact with your controller at. So you better fucking do it. Who cares how they're modeled? Excuse me, where are the rest of them? Hello? There's no more. <laughs> They're all gone. What is this? This way to Sandy's room. Oh, hello. Maybe they're like on the ground floor. <laughs> He's just... SpongeBob. Yes, narrator. They are watching you. Huh? Who? The ones behind the screen. You mean? Yes, I mean those. How long have they been watching me? For as long as you can remember, and even longer. 
Would you like to take your freedom back, SpongeBob? More than anything in the world. You have the means, do you not? All right. Get the fuck over here! <laughs> Get the fuck over here! stream just ends. <laughs> Actual jump scare. <laughs> Sandy, is it possible you're imagining these last four? <laughs> Say it again, SpongeBob. Okay, I won't. <laughs> maybe, I don't know, maybe they're at the bottom. <laughs> oh, God. <sighs> Bubbles. Oh shit, those are the wasps! Ah! Okay. They're literally, they ain't worth shit. They're so scary. Oh yeah! This is happening! We are the watchers of a hundred eyes, Spongebob. We have seen you die a thousand times and will watch you die a thousand more. You will never be free. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Sponeb. <laughs> Sponeb. Oh my god, I can't, I guess I'm yawning. This game is just so boring. <laughs> okay, this gotta be the last one, right? No, this isn't even a wasp, it's pants. Classic mistake. Shit. Mix this up all the time, yeah. You fool! You fell victim to one of the classic blunders! <laughs> these are not... These are pants, not wasps. I don't know, I, I, I guess I maybe got them all. This sure is uh, one of the video games of all time, huh? Me putting my wasps on before I go to work. Wait. Ha <laughs> ha, you fool! <laughs> there are no more stingy thingies in your tree dome, Sandy. That was some mighty fine wrangling, SpongeBob. I'm going inside my treehouse for a rest. See you later, SpongeBob. Oh god, Sandy, look out! Holy shit! She really just not, she's not give a fuck. Spawn ebb. <laughs> Defeat Sandy in a karate match. Didn't we already do that? Do I have to do it two more times? What the fuck? Gather 100 doubloons in the tree dome. In the tree dome. Um. Okay. No. How do I challenge her to more... I'm just gonna follow her into her room, I guess? A 
that's, you know, totally non-invasive thing to do. Oh, shit! Oh, Mr. Oh, she didn't square up! What the fuck? She here. was ready! Prepare yourself for another defeat! Is that supposed to scare me? What the fuck? I've been practicing since our last match, and I've learned some new moves. Now pay attention. We've got a short amount of time to bust up all this junk in my treehouse. The one who breaks she the was, most she, stuff when time runs out is the this. winner. She expected this. Now here are some. They have like moves. they have a fucking like Hold understanding. Spot, like like when she, like, you know they're giving off the wrong impression Ow. to everybody else out Ow. when they go out because like she'll be like, oh you know I'm 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 pretty pooped you know I'm gonna Ow. I'm gonna head to bed. Ow. Time to go back home. And then SpongeBob is like, oh yeah Sandy I'll I'll uh, follow you back. I uh, left something at your uh, tree dome last time I visited. Ow. And everybody's like, Ooh, what the are they? Canoodling up there in Sandy's room. And then they get upstairs and they're just like, Square up! <laughs> just beat the shit out of each other. Ow. Oh shit! Oh, we're not. I just literally just realized we're not actually fighting her. We're doing the box thing again. Except it's not boxing. <laughs> <laughs> Look at how fucking good I am. We won the last second. Must contain immense karate powers. Well, shuck, SpongeBob. That was some tussle. Another one. Ow! 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 <laughs> embrace the bloodshed. <laughs> okay, one more. Are you gonna give me another one? <laughs> I'm back for round three. <laughs> Really? I can't. How do I activate the... I thought I was just stuck for real. Oh, shit. Now I'm truly prepared. <laughs> okay, well, I guess I'm going. <laughs> That's very good. <laughs> Just the way it pops out. Okay, I guess I'll get the hundred whatever the fucks. Funny video game. Oh, yeah, it's one of these again. Okay. Don't fucking do that, Sandy. Wait, is it going to be in the same position every single time? What the fuck is sound design? Sound design is when you stack sounds one on top of the other.
Yeah, like Jenga blocks. Like Jenga blocks. Fuck. Pants first, treasure later. Yuck. Are we, are we building a person? That's, that's like the horrifying, well, what do we have so far? We have a sock and teeth. I've been looking for you. Sorry, oh no, not Squidward. Over. You should have shown up on time if you wanted to buy something. I never buy what I want. I just take it. And you're what I'm here for. Another member for my ghostly crew. But according to my book on evil spirits, the Flying Dutchman is only supposed to take the ones who disturb his rest. But that little snail fella is working out so well, and my old crew is so lazy. Can't we overlook that rule just this once? Just think how nice it will be when you're a member of the Dutchman's crew. <laughs> Squidward, yeah, Squidward like knows the lore. It's like I've read up on this. I, I, in my like in my history class. Oh yeah, he did have the book, didn't he? Damn, it really is all coming together in a way. In a way <laughs> of sorts. <laughs> all right, well we're back. I guess that was all a dream. Let's go. How many levels are there? There's Bingy, Brown, Down, Down, Treedom, Jellyfish, Chum World, Gulagoon, Dutchman. That's, that's not too bad. I see why this was pretty short. Loading. I'm like, I'm swiftly, like, I'm like crashing. <laughs> I'm like, my energy is just like depleting. 